Hello everyone, I'm Slumpy. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today, I'll be taking you on an adventure around Bangkok, Thailand, showing you the two different floating markets I went to, an art museum, and showing you the streets that I explored. I hope you'll enjoy this video. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoy. Thank you. I visited the first floating market by myself. It was called Klong Bang Luang Floating Market, and it was definitely a very artsy environment. All of the shops there were selling art, art supplies, or inviting you to make your own creation, such as a bracelet. Remember, before you go into any of the buildings at this market, you need to take off your shoes. The sights were absolutely beautiful, and there was a lot of little shops where you could stop and get something to drink as well. I visited a beautiful temple not too far from where I was staying, and lucky for me, I made a little orange friend. How could you not love this cute little face? After visiting this beautiful temple and paying my respects, I continued back to my hostel where I would spend the night resting. I went with my friend to another floating market. This floating market was called Klong La Mayam Floating Market, and it was definitely a lot bigger than the one I had previously been to and had more options for food. This time, we also decided to take a boat ride. It was absolutely beautiful. We ended up visiting a smaller floating market on our boat tour, and we also stopped at a beautiful orchid garden. I had a ton of fun with my friend in just taking in all of the sights, smells, and everything there was to do. We took the boat back to the floating market and enjoyed the last bit of our scenic ride. We noticed that the market seemed to be closing, so we had to go elsewhere for food. We headed on over to Chinatown in Thailand to find some good food to eat. It was amazing. I visited the Bangkok Art and Culture Center twice on my own. Both times were beautiful, and as I had stopped in Bangkok twice during my trip, once upon my arrival, and the second time after I took the train back up from the south, I visited this beautiful art museum with tons of exhibitions. The first time I visited, there was also a small artist gathering. Many talented artists were selling their works. I bought a couple, but I can't show those as they're gifts for my friends. I had an overall great experience and though a lot of people warned me that the city would be too hectic and that I wouldn't like it, I actually quite fell in love with Bangkok, and I hope to come back again sometime soon. Thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed, and please remember to like this video, subscribe if you want to follow me for more eco-travel adventures, and maybe leave a comment if you're feeling up for it. Again, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much again, and I hope you have a wonderful day, night, or whatever time it is for you. Peace from around the world, and thanks for watching. Bye!